Hello everyone, welcome again in Angman YouTube channel. So in this video, we will continue our learning on T-Navigator, a reservoir simulation software, which is very useful. And today's topic is about OLGR or local grid refinement. It's a very good feature for us to use in reservoir simulation, especially if you want to get a more focused a more detailed evaluation on a particular area okay so again i will use uh, an example case from the navigator so hopefully we can learn many many things from this case okay so i'm opening a lgr case from the navigator sample we are currently looking at a two-dimensional map especially it's about the pressure Okay, so it's pressure map, all right? You can also click this one to get a 3D view. Okay, we can move the time slider. Okay, and you can see the wells out there. And again, of course, we are looking at the user interface, but behind this visualization, of course, are files, okay? Like the grid are taken from these files, the properties are taken from these files, the region, solution, summary, and the well schedule are actually taken from those files, all right? So in this case, we will look at the user interface as well as the script or the file. All right, so this is the map that we have, you go to here, okay, and to the map, and here, you can see LGR at current step. You can change to do not show at current step or show all, but we cannot see, we cannot look at any LGR right now. Why? Because we haven't shown the grid lines. So if we go back to at current time step and we show the grid lines, easily we can locate where the LGR is. All right. So you can see there are LGRs. Okay. Usually the normal cell the, the size is here, but for the LGR, we can see a smaller cells, right? Smaller cells. So for this one, particularly this one, one cell is divided uniformly into nine cells. One cell divided into nine cells. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. You can also look at the 3D view on this one grid lines and you can get the grid lines all right the same thing if you change to saturation of oil saturation of water and so on and so forth including initial all right so those two are the lgr all right and let me go to saturation of oil again. So, all right. But before that, let's go back to 2D. And you see here in this LGR, we have uniform smaller cells, right? Smaller cells with uniform size. But if we go to the left LGR, the size are different, all right? This one different from this one and different from these columns. Why? I'm going to explain it later. All right, so let's go to the files. And this is the mother file, LGR model data. All right, 